Like night in Oswald Michali's uh, nightfall in Soweto, death came like a dreaded disease unannounced, seeped through the pores of his healthy body and damaged it beyond repair. At the residence of the deceased in the Kusapi district of Abuja, Nigerians across ethnic, political and religious divides came to pay their last respect. His son, Omam Ujubo, in an emotion-laden tone, speaks with a rise news on his father's state of health before death struck. Oh, um, he passed away while watching the football game. So I think it was during the second um, penalty. Nigeria conceding the second penalty and um, he kind of screamed and gave way. You know, it was horrible and sad. Um, he wasn't sick. I wouldn't say he was sick per se, but he had like a heart condition. You know, and he was supposed to do surgery, but he was just delaying it because of like um, the chances of success. So he just decided that he was gonna like just roll with it and just see how it goes. And I guess it didn't go properly then. Um, it was sad. It was shocking. Um, he's my best friend. Um, we talk a lot. Um, he's um not just my dad. He's um my you know he's my everything. You know. I'll miss him. But for his distraught wife, speech was elusive. Late Cairo Ojiwa's neighbor and socialite, Obi Kubana, was among the personalities who came to pay condolence. He shares his experience and how he lost another friend in Cote d'Ivoire in a similar circumstance during the match between Nigeria and South Africa. We hardly say because we are always ever busy. But um, he was a very peaceful man. We've and uh, enjoy the wonderful and cordial relationship I've never, never had any issue whatsoever. I woke up to the root shock and I'm still yet to get over it. We just pray to God to grant his soul repose and then for us living to realize uh, the transient thing called life. I mean it's happened so sudden that I'm still yet to come out of the shock. May God grant his so peace. Amen. Cairo's political journey began as the chairman of the Alliance for Democracy from 1998 to 1999. He was later the presidential lieutenant officer on National Assembly and special assistant to former President Goodluck Jonathan on National Assembly, which marked his commitment to public service. He was People's Democratic Party's national vice chairman and chairman for the South South and Deputy National Chairman. In 2019, Dr. Cairo Ojibu entered the governorship race in Delta State under the platform of the All Progressive Congress.